what's going on everybody if you're new here welcome if you're already subscribed welcome back my name is david my wife and i do all kinds of food content on this channel so if you guys love all things food and you enjoy these videos please consider give uh, you know consider subscribing if you haven't already give them a thumbs up you know share the videos with your friends and family all that's free it helps out the channel and we'd greatly appreciate it everybody thank you very much and if you're new here at 2,500 subscribers, we're giving away $100 free. So all you got to do, you know, you got to be subscribed. And it's free to subscribe. So somebody <coughs> at 2,500 subscribers, one lucky subscriber is getting 100 buckaroos for free. Yeah, that's right. No purchase necessary. It's free. All right, guys. So today, you saw the thumbnail. We're heading on over to the burger world. Going to grab up this burger and fries and see how it is. I've never had one of these before. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over there, grab up the uh, food at the Burger World, then we'll find a place to park it, and then by the end of the video, I'll let you know, was it a good value? You know, was the price good for what we got? Did we get the right thing? Was it made right? And was it any good as far as taste-wise? I'll let you know. So make sure you stay all the way till the end, guys. All right, I'll see you over at the Burger World. Mm, Harry. All right, everybody, here we are. Burger World. All right. All right, everybody, let me go pick up my order here at the driveway. And then uh, we'll go find a place to park it and we'll get into this thing. See how it is. I'll see you when we find a place to park it. For Pete's sake. All right, everybody, we found a place to park it. How's everybody doing today? As always, let me know down there in the comments. How's everybody doing? Where are you watching from? Let me know if you've had this burger. The BK, the Bacon King. I've never had it before, so I figured I'd try it and let you guys know uh, what I thought about it. Mm, Harry. All right, guys. We're going to get into this thing right now. All right. You know what I got? The Risset, Pete's sake. All right, so we got the Bacon King and Fries. I guess it's some. It's on the app. You know, they offer both of them for a certain price, which was ten dollars his and ninety nine pennies. Then we got the Rhode Island No Vaseline Tax, eighty eight pennies, for a total of eleven dollars his and eighty seven pennies. That's crazy, dude. Better be a good sandwich for that price. And I don't even think this is even that great of a much of a deal that they offer on the app because I think you're saving like maybe a dollar between the between that sandwich and the fries. You save like a buck. Oh wow! Now I can buy that house in France I always wanted for Pete's sake. I got an extra dollar. You want to give something away? How about a hundred bucks for one lucky subscriber? That's right, twenty five hundred subscribers. One lucky subscriber is getting a hundred buckaroos. All right, guys. We got it right here. The handy dandy steering wheel tray, which can be found anywhere on the old interwebs, guys. You got to have this tray if you're doing these uh, food reviews in the car. Because... You get something like this, got bacon on it and all these toppings. I'm sure it's going to be dripping all over the place. You don't, want, you don't want that drippage to hit you in the crumb, for Pete's sake. Keep it on here. what I'm saying. All right. It's about that time we got to put the high chair back. We need some room. Oh, I hear Mary. Wee. All right. Good night. She's heavy. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on the tray. I'm going to bring you guys in, you know, hook your peepers, take a little look-see little and see if it looks visually appetizing to you. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. I don't know. Right. Oh, look at this. Nappies. Very nice. Oh, my God. They're on the ball over there. Look, I got one over on them, guys. Oh, yeah. 
Heavy-handed uh, Sam was over there with a the salt shaker again today. I can see it. Let me salt up these fries. Good night. Look at this. I got the Adams Family rings and things. Little uh, holder here. You know, the little, the little toddler. The little toddler size fries. Well, that's funny because when I did the meal, I didn't get the things rings because they told me it was just regular. There was no special packaging. Now I got the package. I didn't have to spend a thousand. Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right. Good night. Should have brought my scale like uh, Greg's Kitchen does. Woo-wee. She's a happy little goose. God. Let me open this up here. Yeah, let me know, guys. Have you ever had this? I've never had this sandwich. I guess it's uh, their reply to Wendy's Baconator. I don't know. I ain't never had that either. Pete's sake. <laughs> I just want to try a little experiment. Now, I'm going to shake this bag. There's nothing in it except the fries, where the fries fell out of the little uh, things rings package. Let's see if we can hear any salt in it. Did you hear all that salt from just a few fries that fell out of that thing? Did you get anything to drink with this combo, Dave? No, no, I got something. I'm, I brought my own drink. What did you get? I'm glad you asked. Mm -hmm. Good to have you, Blue Monster. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's get into this thing. I open it up. I bring you guys in for a look see loo Shit, good night. Let me just check with the Google machine and it can let you know exactly what this thing is. Oh, Google machine, what is the Bacon King from Burger King sandwich? According to Burger King, our Bacon King features two savory flame grilled 100% beef burgers topped with hearty portion of thick cut smoked bacon, melted American cheese and topped with ketchup and creamy mayonnaise all on a soft sesame seed bun. They say a hearty amount of bacon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't think so, but I'll bring you in for the looksy loo right here, right now. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, let's start with the burger here from Burger World. That's a hearty bunch of bacon. <laughs> if you say so. So here's the bun, top bun. She got a lot of mayo and ketchup, I guess. Then you got your burger patties. I love, I'd say Burger King is probably my favorite burger patty. But let me know in the comments what yours is. So you got some uh, cheese here that looked like a, got heated up in a nuclear attack. And you got your bacon over here. These are fries that spilled out. Oh, good night. Tell you what, I love a little bit of fries with my salt. There's the other ones there. All right. So this is the meal. You know what it costs. There's the looksy loo view. All right. Let me put you back up on the dash. We'll get into this thing. For Pete's sake. All right. You guys are back up on the dash. Let's get into this thing. It's going to be interesting. All right. All right. Well, let's just try it out and see how it is. I, it feels pretty heavy. There ain't no way I'm eating all this. I'm definitely, this is like two meals for me. Here we go. Hammer. Mm -hmm. Also, the bun is, you know, looks like it had a little accident here or there, but it's nice and soft. First bite, first impression, 
not a bad burger, but I wouldn't expect anything less from uh, Burger World. I love plain broiled burgers. Not bad. And of course we got the uh, fries with the salt. Very nice. Very good, very good. Everything's nice and warm. Obviously. Well, I'm only about, literally, this is the Burger King in uh, Cranston on Pontiac Ave. It's at the corner of Sakonasa and Pontiac. So I'm literally, I can literally see the place from here. Yeah, so it's still warm. It should be after only like 30 seconds away, maybe. She's very good. Very good. I tell you what, I don't know how much it costs or if it does cost anything extra to get lettuce and tomato on this thing. I'm telling you, you put lettuce and tomato on there, you got yourself a bacon double whopper. Man, that is good. That is one heck of a sandwich. It's one of those uh, sandwiches that they get over at... Uh, Burger World over there when you start eating it you can just feel your heart slowing down Yeah, probably one more bite and then I'll probably uh, Wrap it up back in the uh, salt lick bag. I'll have it later for dinner, but That's a lot of food. This is good though. I don't know about that hearty bacon, but It's good All right, everybody. Let me get this mess cleaned up I'll be right back with my final thoughts on my score. Okay? Be right back. All right, guys, we get that mess cleaned up. Let me just start with the value, the price, as I always do. Uh, which was that thing in? Oh, uh, just short of twelve dollars for a double, double big ass burger with uh, some bacon on it. I mean, I don't know. I don't usually buy burgers that big, but it's one of the ones that they, you know, they sent sent me an offer on, in the app, and I've never had it before, so I figured I'd try it. It's a little too much for me, you know. Maybe, uh, you know, like I said, let me know in the comments if you had this thing. It's definitely the big, it seems like the big patties, like a, a Whopper patty, not a Whopper Junior, the Whopper size patty. So you get two of those, two things of cheese, some bacon, some um, mayonnaise, and some uh, ketchup on there. It was all right. The bun was a little bit. Uh, the bun was a little bit off. It was a little bit stale on one side. So let's just start with the value. I don't think it's a good value. That that's twelve dollars for a double double cheeseburger, basically with some a double bacon cheeseburger. Yeah, it's got the bigger patties, but so I'm gonna go with the value on that. I'm gonna go about a seven. I don't think it's a really good value, not for that price. Plus, it's too much to eat. Maybe you can eat the whole thing. I don't. Maybe you have two of them for lunch. I don't know. Pete's sake. I don't know. But these are just my opinions. Obviously, we all have different opinions. That's what's make the world go round, Pete's sake. So let me know in the comments. What did you think? You think uh, uh, twelve dollars for for that sandwich and some toddler fries? Nah, I give the value about a seven. Now, as far as the taste, like I've said before, Burger World has has my favorite uh, patties, flame broiled. They, oh, they're always delicious. So. On the taste itself, I mean, the cheese looked like it was microwaved. The patties were really good. Uh, as far as the uh, the mayonnaise seemed all right. The, like I said, the bun, the bun was stale on one part of it. So, <sighs> as far as taste, I give it about a seven. Give it about a seven. The fries, if you've been watching this channel for the past year, you know heavy-handed Larry over there. He, you know, he's always double-fisted with a salt shaker on those fries. Guy goes crazy for Pete's sake. So the fries, they're always about a five, you know. 
but I think overall overall on the whole thing I'd give it about a six the only thing that's really saving it is those delicious patties that's about it so that was my review on the uh was that bacon the bacon king See, they, they left out the rest of that sentence the bacon king but they left of salt pete's sake is what i'm saying all right guys as always if you stay until the end thank you very much we greatly appreciate it we love everybody in our foodie family guys Again, a lot of new subscribers. Thank you guys for who have, you know, everybody who's been subscribing. And like I said, at 2,500 subscribers, one lucky subscriber is getting $100 for free. So, and it's free to subscribe. All you do is hit a button and you get a chance to win 100 bucks. How can you beat that with a stick? All right, guys, as always, it's getting late. I got to get out of here. Things to do, places to go, people to see. All right. So, I will see you guys tomorrow on Thursday. Thursday is the next video. I'll see you guys Thursday for another brand new food review. Again, guys, stay till the end. Thank you very much. My name is David. I hope you guys have a blessed day. And I'll see you guys on Thursday for the next brand new food review. Have a blessed day, everybody. Bye-bye. Oh, no, you don't.